Also new in 10.3.3 is macOS 64-bit Catalina support and iOS 13 support. And this allows you to target the Apple App Store and the latest macOS and iOS versions. So for Delphi, we provide macOS 64-bit Catalina support, and this comes complete with notarization support for macOS Catalina. Now for both Delphi and C++ Builder, we provide iOS 13 support, and this includes the addition of dark theme support. Dark theme is something that was introduced with iOS 13, and you can now support that in your FireMonkey applications. And with that, let's have a look at our iOS 13 dark theme support in action. Now let's have a look at what this looks like in action. All you have to do is either open your existing FireMonkey project or create a new FireMonkey multi-device application. And if you want to support both the light and dark theme, all you have to do is deploy that application. It's automatically built in. And with iOS 13, you can choose to support either light or light and dark theme with your application. And we are also offering that now as part of the FireMonkey framework support that we provide for iOS. So this includes support for detecting the user's iOS setting and automatically switching between the light and dark theme without requiring an application restart.